Hi guys, this video is about how I got my channel, my YouTube channel back. Uh, if you're just going through this now, <clears throat> try to go through the step by step uh, how I did it. Now you'll find a lot of uh, YouTube uh, videos out there on how I got my channel back in you know overnight or the next days or in in four days well it took me three weeks to get mine back now, I'm not saying everybody's gonna get theirs back in three or four days but let me tell you the process that I went through uh, and it did work I mean I understand that uh, Google has probably thousands of people they're looking after uh, trying to get fixed up, their channel gets fixed up, their uh, Gmail gets fixed up. Uh, so I was just one, but I felt like I was the only one at times. Like I needed service. <clears throat> and you just have to bide your time and wait. And so anyways, what I done was you tell the complete truth on how you lost your channel to begin with. Uh, I lost mine. <clears throat> I'm thinking by trying to download a uh, a free piece of trying to download a free piece of software uh, like a light version of something, and I'm thinking that's where it was for me, and it, it got a piece of malware which took over my uh, Gmail account that has control over my YouTube account. So just remember, you have a Gmail account that got compromised for me. Uh, they changed the password. The uh, Gmail account was still the same name. They changed the password and they changed this uh, two-step verification phone number also. Um, so when I would try to get into that account, I would get the password wrong or it would al allow me to use the password that was in there, but then it would say, uh, the window would pop up uh, looking for a verification code that was sent to the particular phone number. Well, that phone number has been changed, so I still couldn't get in. So these are the steps that I took. First of all, believe it or not, you go to Twitter and uh, follow um, Team YouTube on Twitter and then ask your questions now if you follow them if you do, if you're not followed already they'll ask you to follow them uh, once you do follow them then you can ask your question ask your question through team YouTube on Twitter now I did this and at first I you know I asked I told them what my my, my uh, channel was hacked and my Gmail was hacked and that Gmail is controlling almost everything I was doing <clears throat> with that particular Gmail account. So I couldn't really go to too many places, couldn't do too many things. My channel was also run by that particular Gmail account. So I have to get that one back in order to get my, my uh, YouTube channel back. <clears throat> so I asked my question at Team YouTube uh, on, on Twitter. And it wasn't actually, I got pretty good response back, like it would time, like next day, uh, sometimes same day. But they would ask me more specific questions about the uh, situation. Uh, I guess trying to more or less identify who I am. Believe it or not, it's hard to, it's hard to uh, prove who you are, <laughs> really, believe it or not. I, that's what my biggest point was, is proving who I was. To, to Google. Um, so once I conversed back and forth with them, it telling them uh, I can't get into this Gmail account, they would say, well, uh, go to this particular link and try to log in. And uh, once you're in to do this and that, and I kept explaining to them that I can't get in, I can't get past the phone number change the phone number back to mine and everything will be okay. Um, 
As a matter of fact, uh, on that particular Gmail account, I could type any password in and it would, l it would allow me to get in up to the point where it wants to send that a code to my phone number. Well, the wrong phone number again. So, believe it or not, it was after a week and a half of trying to get back and forth with uh, Team YouTube, which was pretty hard, I began to think that these were, it, it was a, a bot and not a human <coughs> that I was talking to because of the questions I would ask and the answers that I would get. It just, uh, it, it didn't seem quite right to me that, that this was a, <coughs> excuse me, a, uh, I was speaking to a human. So I out, just outright asked them, I said, is this a bot I'm speaking to or is this a, are you humans or what? And the response I got back was, oh, we're human. So, I mean, a bot could still answer that question like that. But anyway, so I, okay, I'll trust you and think that you're a human being. So give me some proper answers. How come I can't get on? You gave me the link to go to, recovery link. I went through all that. None of that works for me. So they said, okay, here's a special link to get a hold of Google and to get your Gmail account sorted out. So I figured, oh, okay, great. Now we're going to maybe speak to Google uh, because you can't, there isn't a phone number. You can't call any human person. So here we go again. But at least I was transferred to uh, a, a Google website or a, a Google uh, recovery uh, site. So on there, I asked my question. Uh, they came back and said, uh, yes, indeed, my channel has been compromised. My Gmail account has been compromised. And they're working hard and diligently to try to correct the thing. Now, I noticed on my YouTube channel, uh, whoever the hacker was put up six videos on there, posted them, and each of those six videos would have been a strike against my uh, <coughs> against my channel because they were about crypto coin and uh, Bitcoin and, and uh, how to hack and things like that. Just if, if, you're, if you were one of those that clicked on those, please don't don't follow any links on those things. I, would, I, I got the chance to take them off now that I've got my channel back though. And besides, uh, Google took them off for me. They were still in my uh, my back office, kind of on, on YouTube in the studio, so I took them off completely. So, anyways, I got to conversing back and forth with actual YouTube, and I asked the question. I would get the answer, and now it's feeling more like a bot again, and not human beings. But they kept assuring me at the very end of their uh, text. They would say that. They're looking into this, blah, blah, blah. And so then they would say that they opened up the Gmail account to go in, change the password, and everything should be good to go. So, okay, I go log into, the, I tried to log into that Gmail account, uh, put in a password, a new password that I thought was, I could remember. Then I hit next, and it said, another window popped up and says, uh, Google cannot verify who I am. You're locked out. Oh, boy. So back to Google. Text back and forth to Google. Uh, explained the situation. Actually took screenshots and sent those along. Now, the form that you fill out when they try to verify who you are Make sure that you fill it out to the, your, your best of your knowledge and complete. Uh, they'll ask you about how you think you were compromised. Tell them the whole truth about that, whether you were doing something not, uh, you know, so not, not legal <laughs> or whatever. But make if you're trying to get your channel back, make sure that you answer all those questions to the best of your ability anyways. So... Another <coughs> couple days go by, and they came back and said, okay, this is what we've done. We've got your YouTube channel. We took off those six videos that were uh, on there that somebody else posted. Um, we've 
opened up your uh, Gmail account so that you should be able to get in with your particular phone number <clears throat> now in there. And so I thought, well, okay, let's give this a shot. So I just went to my YouTube channel without logging in, just as a, as a viewer. And what do you know, those six videos were gone. So I thought, okay, let's log in and see if I can get in. So I logged into that Gmail account, which I did get in. The password was the one that I saved. And it came to my phone number for the second uh, step verification. Pa put in the passcode and what do you know, we're into our Gmail account. So let's go and see if we can get into our YouTube account, most importantly. So I go to YouTube, my, my YouTube account, and what do you know, we are back in business. So this took three weeks of conversing back and forth. Um, it might have been a little quicker if I would have checked my emails more often, but I'm sitting my co my computer was hacked my youtube channel was hacked my phone was hacked and i'm in another country uh, i'm in mexico and i'm trying to do this you know <laughs> so thank you uh, google for trusting who i was from a different you know, from a visiting country and i'm trying to tell them this in my text back and forth to them that i i'm visiting mexico and i'm not you know, like they're asked, what's your IP address? And I said, well, I'm from Alberta, actually, but visiting in Mexico. So I had that hassle too. So finally, and I got a new phone when I got back. And so my phone is great now. I've got my YouTube channel back. I've got that uh, Gmail account back. Changed all the passwords. Uh, made it a two-step, three-step, whatever. Uh, verification however many it takes I don't want this to happen again so if you've lost your channel and you know what it feels like uh, it doesn't matter how big you are I'm just a small youtuber and when you lose your however many hundreds of videos you have on there and figure you're not going to get anything back you can't get into your channel you can't do anything with your channel go back watch this video from the beginning and it'll explain what to do go to the team YouTube on Twitter to start your whole conversation they will direct you eventually to Google and their support team and they'll help you out believe me so stay tuned guys